Hey guys, my name is Panzer6, and this is a new episode of the Game Feed. And today we're talking about System Wars, Console Wars, or whatever you want to call it. Now this is my third time I've tried to do this because I've kind of got heated every time I've tried to do this, and it's made me lose my train of thought. And that may happen because this is not something I like to talk about because it pisses me off. <laughs> and I'm going to try to keep it as calm and as collective as I possibly can. Um, for you guys that are new to the console sort of video gaming, uh, the console wars is basically, or system wars, is basically a way of saying my console was better than your console because of this, or my console is better than your console because of that. And you usually have different factions, rather be your Xbox people, your PlayStation people, your Nintendo, or your PC people, which or your mobile people, your people play just on phones, and it shouldn't matter. In all actuality, it should be all under one thing, and that's gamers. It shouldn't just be like different factions of gamers. It should be gamers. And that could be if you're just playing Magic the Gathering or poker or tic-tac-toe. You're a gamer. That's a form of gaming. And <laughs> I, I, I'm not going to lie. I used to be one of those guys that used to be one-sided. I was an Xbox guy. That's all I was. I used to play Xbox. Xbox this. I would not buy a con Sony console. But I did have... I had a PlayStation 2, PlayStation 3. You know, I opened up to it. And this was a, about five years ago. But I branched out. And thank God I did because it's awesome. I mean, I, I've, I've played everything from, you know, Atari all the way to the Xbox One. And I get all the consoles as soon as they come out. I'm one of those guys that I have to have the newest, the best thing I don't really care what's selling. I have a Wii U. I love it. It's one of the best consoles I've ever had. Even though it's not doing too well, it's still amazing. It has some of the best games you can get on all three of the platforms. And I, I don't care what anybody says. Um, it doesn't have to have absolutely stunning graphics to be fun. And the Wii U is a really great example of it. all you have to do is look at the reviews of the last few titles that's come out and you could tell they're better than most console other console titles but the reason why i wanted to talk about the console wars is just the fact that you know mpd numbers is coming soon and M mpd numbers came out this month and you start to see every time mpd number numbers come out a trend where You'll have these bigger websites or um, Machinima. That's a good example. And they do this every month, and I'm calling them out on it because it's absolute garbage. It's bullshit, and all it does is cause more problems. And I think they like that. That's what they're aiming for. But every month, the MPD numbers comes out. You see <laughs> their videos like, Xbox is losing the console wars, or PlayStation is losing the console wars. And once you open the video up, you have the two guys. I forgot their names. I used to watch them when Adam Kovic and everybody was on there, and I loved it. But they're now on, now on Funhouse, and you guys check them out. These guys are an absolute blast. But um, every time uh, you open up their video, they'll say, oh, we don't care. But if you didn't care, why would you put the clickbait title in there? Then you'll check the YouTube con comments, and it's all, all out fucking war. It's a mess. Everybody's like, you suck, you, I hate you, your mom, Xbox is better, PlayStation is better, and it is filthy, and it brings out the worst in gaming community. It's almost embarrassing, especially if you get on some of the forums. Uh, NeoGAF used to be terrible. They're quite tame now compared to what they used to be, but one of the worst ones I've ever been on is uh, GameSpot System Wars, and every time something like that comes out where um, if... There's good news for the Xbox or good news for the PlayStation or Nintendo. You, if you go onto the system more thing, it's it's terrible. Like, I, I don't even want to <laughs> comment on some of the things they say, but it does. It really does bring out the worst in gamers. And this is why you shouldn't care about this stuff. Say if you're new coming into gaming, if you're making your foray into gaming, and you choose to go mobile. Say if you just choose to play either on your tablet or you know your phone or something like that. You're still considered a gamer. If you even you're just playing Flappy Bird or Angry Birds every once in a while, that's your form of gaming. That's something you like. Um, 
you shouldn't be put down because you like it. Even though it's not my cup of tea, that's what you enjoy. It's not what I enjoy. You shouldn't be put down because you chose that platform. It shouldn't be like that. And I think as gamers, um, we, we feel entitled to say if we only have one console um, or we can only afford one console, which I'm not saying that's bad. Um, I used to have... I used to have a really good job, and I was able to afford all that stuff. That's why I have all the consoles and a really nice PC and all this stuff. So I can't really... I don't have that now because I'm unemployed, but that's something I used to have. And I'm fairly lucky to have that. And um, But we feel entitled if we have a specific console and not the other. And we want to be like, oh, mine's better because of this. Or mine's better because of that. And the best way to argue this is hop on to forums or comment sections or uh, YouTube or Twitter, you name it, and just argue these things. And no matter what you do, you're not going to win these arguments. I could sit here and say, hey, you shouldn't fight this way. You shouldn't do this. You should just be happy that you are a gamer. But that's not going to change your mind. I could be the most influential person in the world like uh, Gandhi and say be happy you're a gamer that's not going to change your fucking mind that's not you're going to choose one or the other but this is what I want to say and I'm a fairly small channel so I'm not going to have a huge grab huge grab so I'm at least going to try to give my opinion on it and maybe if you do see this, maybe you will change your mind a little bit. Maybe you'll open up a little bit. But you should be a gamer. You should classify yourself as a gamer. You shouldn't classify yourself as a PlayStation fanboy, an Xbox fanboy. You shouldn't do that. You shouldn't have to care. We live in a time where we're where the video game industry is huge. We have all these awesome games coming out every every month. Every day we have something awesome to look forward to. doesn't matter what system you're on. And you should be really happy about that. I mean, we've grown a lot since the 80s. I mean, we survived a fucking crash. And look at us now. We are bigger than Hollywood. We are huge. We are gamers. And we should get night. We should all be happy about that. I mean... I, if you're a PlayStation fanboy and I'm an Xbox fanboy, I would be happy to play the PlayStation with you. I, actually, you could come to my house tomorrow and you and I can sit down and play Rocket League together. Or we can play Last of Us together. I don't care which console you choose. And you shouldn't either. You should be happy. This is a great time to live if you're a gamer. you got everything going for you. you got... You know, games on mobile. You got card games. I play Magic the Gathering. It's not be It's not any better than uh, Xbox or PlayStation. It's all a game. It's it's something you enjoy. It's a hobby. You shouldn't be put down to it. This isn't uh, this isn't um, you know civil rights or anything like that. This is just we shouldn't do this to each other. We should all just be happy for you know what we've got. And I'm sure this is if if you don't own an Xbox or a PlayStation, you only own one platform, and you want to play this game. I'm sure it sucks. Yes, yes, but don't put somebody down because you know they have something nicer than you coming out, or something you know as not as nice came out and is better on your platform. Don't put them down. At least they get to play that game. And you know it does sucks having you know these these console exclusive DLCs that you know we seen E3 E3 was all about especially on Sony's uh, press conferences you get this exclusive DLC for this game or this game's exclusive uh, content just for this it's it's fucking terrible I mean you want if you're going to get a game you're going to want all that content. It shouldn't be exclusive, but that's how that's how it works. It's how we work and we, you know, one console is going to get shorted from the other because, you know, these big corporations make these deals with these other um, you know, gaming giants. So it this just happens. And yes, this is a little convoluted because it does make me a little aggravated talking about it because it's just something I hate, but I think you 
should take out of this is we should be happy as gamers. We should come together as gamers. We shouldn't have to fight each other because your console's better than my console or PC Master Race or I, I don't care what it is. You shouldn't have to worry about that. Um, just be happy. Be a gamer. Fucking celebrate. It's like we can all be, you know, <laughs> we could be fine together. We don't have to have war. War is bad. But um, I hope you took something out of it at least, um, even though it's a little bit convoluted uh, from what I said. Sometimes I can't get the words out like I want to say it, but sometimes I want to get it out the best I can, so at least you get the general idea of what I'm talking about. And what I'm trying to get out is be happy to be a gamer. Just stop the hate. Just, just appreciate it. Just let it all soak in. I mean, take a look at the gaming history of the last, you know, 25 years or so and see how far we've come. We're awesome. We are an awesome piece of culture. We are an awesome, awesome group of people. And it's going to get better. But as long as we have this type of poison in our industry, it's not going to get better. It's, it's just going to get worse and we're never going to get along. But... Come on, guys, just, just get along with each other, have fun, and if you see somebody that has a different console as you, just be nice. Don't be a dick. <laughs> but, guys, thanks so much for at least listening to us, um, listen to what I say. Um, I hope you guys enjoy. Be sure to hit the like and follow button. And as always, I'll see you guys next week with a new episode of the Game Feed. And take it easy, guys.